So, you heard about this thing called Google Tag Manager. Or maybe someone told you that you absolutely must use it. But do you really need it? Honestly, the answer is, it depends. And in this video, I will help you decide. First of all, you need to understand what Google Tag Manager is. If you want to install some marketing or analytics tracking code on your website, you have several options. One of them is to add the tracking code directly to the source code of the website. That's usually done by developers. If your developers are responsive and they are often available, they can do it fairly quickly. But what if your developers are very busy and you need to wait days or weeks to add the tracking codes? That's where Google Tag Manager becomes very handy. It allows marketers and analysts to manage tracking codes in a single place and install them faster. Developers will still be needed sometimes, but often you will be able to do the job yourself. Now, back to the main question. Do you need Google Tag Manager? The answer depends on how your business operates. If you don't know how to code, if you don't have direct access to the website code, and if you need to wait a lot of time for developers to add the codes, then Google Tag Manager is a solution for you. However, you need to understand that Google Tag Manager adds one more layer of complexity because someone must know how to use it. It might be you, it might be your employee, or maybe you can hire someone. But it's a tool that requires specific knowledge and someone must learn it. So now you need to decide what's better, faster, and more convenient for you and your organization. Would you rather continue asking the developers to match the tracking codes, or would you better dedicate time to learn Google Tag Manager and do it yourself? Because keep in mind, GTM can become complex very quickly. If you have a dedicated developer who is often available and can add tracking codes quickly, then I would say you don't need Google Tag Manager. If we're talking about Google Analytics, you can install it by sending GTag tracking code to the developer. But from my experience, that kind of situation, when developer is always available, is pretty rare. Usually developers are overloaded with tasks and tracking codes are not their top priority. Another example, you are running a small business and you have developer background, which means that you manage your own website and if needed, you can code something there. If you want to install Google Analytics and maybe send some custom events, I would say you don't need Google Tag Manager. Just use GA's native tracking code and add it yourself. With Google Tag Manager, you would need to spend more time trying to learn how to use it properly. Just remember, keep things simple. Choose what's quicker and more convenient in your context. Personally, I am a fan of Google Tag Manager, but your situation can be different and that's okay. So I hope that this video helped you decide. If you think that you need Google Tag Manager after all, then I have something for you. Below the video, you will find a link to a one hour Google Tag Manager tutorial for the beginners. It's a great starting point. Or you can click the video thumbnail somewhere right here if your device supports it. Well, do something. Click the link here or here. By the way, my name is Julius and this YouTube channel is dedicated to Google Tag Manager. So if you want to learn it, then make sure to subscribe.